Not a good idea to ever prune off a healthy green monkey puzzle branches, Araucaria aracana. I'm going to do with my pruners. I'm leaving a little bit sticking out too. I don't want to go too close to the tree. And This monkey tree has been in the ground. I, I bought it. I bought this as a seedling in 1988, March 1988. So it's a pretty tree. I'll leave those on a bit. You bought it in March of... 88. March of 1988 from Valley Garden Center in Langley. It was about $4 in a four inch pot. So you, when you moved here, you brought it over. I brought it over. And you know, the first monkey trees I planted in 1984, where I lived at my last location, I bought them at uh, Fox Club Nursery on Salt Spring and they froze in December, or no, November 1985. It got so cold, they actually froze in zone 8A. 8B. So there's a brown one on there too. So I'm anyway, I left some nubbins on there. But it seems to be almost certain death for monkey trees when you cut off yeah. lower green branches. I see that a lot. People plant these things in their lawn yeah, yeah, and then they yeah. they don't like to bump into them when they're mowing the lawn. So they yeah. they remove all these green branches and then for some reason if it's some sort of virus, sickness it gets, yeah. and then their monkey trees oh. die. I gotta get this out of here too. See this? Oh, yeah. That's gotta oh, go. Good, that was a California lilac. I gotta get that there. Want some more junk for Wendy. And then I'm gonna cut this off too. I got my gloves on because monkey trees are nasty. But one of my favorite trees. I've liked them since I was a little kid. I'm just passing the big ones in Vancouver. And uh, I was pointing them out to mom and dad. Look at those big monkey trees. So that's a monkey puzzle tree. And uh, we have several in our garden here on Salt Spring Island. They're native to Chile and Argentina. Thanks for watching. Cheers.